Now it's 1238. The record breaking heat wave is also scorching our state's famous Sawara cacti. This comes as temperatures have soared above 100 degrees for over a month straight. William Pitts reports. It's now been a month of temperatures over 110 degrees. It's so hot out here, not even the cactuses are surviving. Everyone looks at cactus and say, oh, these are desert plants, so they should be just fine. But cactus are living things. But unlike you and me, they can't get out of the heat or the sun. Kimberly McHugh with the Desert Botanical Garden says this record-breaking stretch of record-breaking heat is breaking the cactus all over the state. They literally can't function, and the way I describe it is they start to suffocate. Here's how. A saguaro uses photosynthesis, like all plants do, but they do half of it at night when it's supposed to be cooler. But this month, it's barely ever dropped below 90 overnight. So just like when we're sleeping, when the cactus is supposed to be recovering, they're really roasting. And that's the same thing for cactus. At a certain temperature for a certain length of time, they just can't do it anymore. This is a, a saguaro that's in pretty good shape. It's standing straight. Push on it. Now I can tell you, this one is really firm, which is great. If it was soft or squishy, that means the cactus is in bad shape. It probably can't hold itself up anymore. If it started to tilt, bad sign. That probably means it's on its way to falling over. And another warning sign that you've probably seen in your own yard. Sun scorch. So you start to see yellowing. And not just saguaros. That's happening to pretty much all cactus. McHugh says the garden can try to throw some shade cloth over them, but these things can be 20, 30 feet tall. They're pretty much on their own. And once they're in bad shape, that's pretty much it. If that plant is really starting to shut down, it doesn't matter how much water you pour on them, they won't be able to take it up and do anything with it. The heat can't stay around forever. Eventually, it has to cool down. But for now, even the symbol of the state is struggling to make it through. William Pitts, 12 News.